Nick Tavanella, what's going on? Not much. Junior High State Championships. Now, everybody I've talked to so far, Nick, won um, the Junior High State Championships one time. Nick Skenez or Nate Skenesny, uh Zach Daly, and George D. Camillo, you're the, the fourth guy I've talked to today and one of the five special guests. Um, what do you think that says about this tournament? If you won three high school state titles and you only won this once? Um, it brings together some of the toughest competition in the state, you know, uh, brings together all divisions and all the toughest kids, you know, and if you can win this tournament, you know, you're, you're set for high school and you're uh, preparing yourself the right way. Okay, last weekend state championship match with uh, Garrett Gray. You dominated him in the district finals a week earlier. Yesterday, or uh, last weekend, you, you kind of struggled to, to win an overtime match there. What was the difference between the district final and last week's state final? Uh, he is very well prepared for the state finals match. You know, he broke down my style. I bet you he watched a little film. You know, he just found out how to, how to stop my, the, my main moves that I hit, and you know, he did a great job at it. Did you see yourself going into ultimate tiebreak overtime to win a state title as a senior? No, I did not. You were dominating. It was your third state title. Um, was what, at what point in time were in the match where you're like, man, I could lose this match, and I really got to turn it up? At what point in time did you really turn the switch up to win that one? When I got my second stalling call, when I was down two one. What? Okay. What's going through your mind with the takedown in overtime, and then he reverses you? What's going on? And what's your thinking there? Oh, well, I didn't really didn't know what the score was at that point. Like I, the ref did never clarified if I got two or not because we were still in the middle of action. Uh, and I didn't know I had two, so I, I he, revert, he gave him the, the two, and I just look up at the clock and see the score, what the score was. And five five. It, it wasn't five five because the, the the table workers weren't keeping it updated well enough, and so they had him winning, and that's why Garrett got up and all excited. And then, yeah, yeah, he started celebrating, and yeah. at that point there was a they had a quick conference, and then they made the score right. right. You were down in the last tie break. He couldn't hold you down. Did you just did you at that point you're saying? What was your thoughts then? Just got to get up the win. Just got to, you know, give it the rest of my energy and just get out and not let him get it back down the mat. You did that. You got your third state title. How'd that feel? Awesome. Great, great feeling. All right. Looking at this tournament today, what do you think you guys need to look for? And what do you think you're, what's important about you guys being here? You, George D. Camello, Skenazny, uh, Daly, and Mo uh, Newhouse. I say that's important for us to just uh, to show them that we still care about the youth rest the Ohio wrestling programs, and just uh, it shows them that we still that the the kids that are just graduating high school still expect the youth, the kids coming up to keep the Ohio wrestling tradition going. All right, going to St. Louis. Are you? No. No. Why not? I don't know. You don't know. Your, your guys are wrestling there this next week. I don't know if you know that. I know that. You're not going to go, though? I wasn't planning on it. All right. What are they going to do with you next year? Red shirt, you're going to wrestle? Um, it depends on how I do my wrestle off. If I if I wrestle off and I win my wrestle off and make make a starting lineup, then I'll wrestle. If I lose, I'll probably red shirt me. All right. Well, I'm just glad right now that there's a, a wall in between us. I don't want to have to, to go out and grapple with you right now. I could jump the wall pretty easily. I know. I, that's why I'm going to get ready to run here. Nick, <laughs> thanks for the time. You got anything else for me? Nope. All right. Uh, keep being a good role model, and uh, good luck next year. Thank you.